Hey guys, welcome back to All in and Law. Um, this is what you call a quick internal medicine. And today I'm going to talk about uh, the ABO blood grouping. ABO blood grouping. But here I'm going to talk about who can donate to whom. Okay? Which blood group should donate to whom. Okay? So before starting a discussion on this, I would like to tell you that so, what's it? these ABO blood grouping okay remember there are four major blood groups determined by the presence or the absence of two antigens okay one is A and another one is a B okay and these two antigens are determined on the surface of what you call RBCs if this is a RBC okay I, either it has A or it has a B just for an illustration I'm talking about okay that it can have a a a a a a a antigen on the surface of the RBC red blood cell or either it can be B surface antigen on the surface of the RBC okay now what's a group A if I say my blood group is what you call A, what you think of, okay, means the RBC, right, this is, if this is RBC, the surface antigen, it has only A antigen, A, 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 okay, okay, on RBC, they have what you call A antigen, antigen, and on plasma, in the blood plasma they have B antibodies so that's B antibodies okay B antibodies right if it's a group B then it's going to be RBC that the surface of the RBC you will get a B antigen and the plasma contains A antibodies that's a reverse right now let's talk about the group AB a B A B means they have what you call they have both A and a B surface antigens they, like A B A B A B A B means this blood group with the A B they have both what you call um, antigens that's a group uh, that's A and a B and in the plasma they don't have what you call antibodies neither A nor B antibody in the plasma neither A nor B antibodies in the plasma okay guys so let's talk about the group O group O the group O they have what you call neither A nor B antigens on the our red blood cells means they are plain. They, are, they don't have anything. Nothing, 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 nothing. Means they what the in the plasma they have both the antibodies against A and a B antigen. Okay? That's it. Is it clear guys? Right. Now let's talk about the who can donate to who is really very important. Let's talk about the, we have a different like RH antibodies, right? They are positive or a negative. Let's talk about the A positive. Now tell me, A positive, who can, can give blood to? Uh, the A positive blood group person, he can donate to whom? Tell me. He can donate to A positive and the AB positive. Okay? A positive and the AB positive. Why A positive and AB positive? A is nothing but what? They have a similar antigen, A antigen on the body and they don't have what you call, and they have antibodies against a B. So AB, they don't have what you call antibodies at all. That's why AB can give a blood, uh, what you call A plus positive can give blood to AB. Okay? Right? Yes. And this person, group uh, what you call a blood group a positive can receive blood from whom 
he can receive from a positive that's true okay he can receive from a negative okay and he can receive blood from o positive and he can receive from o negative why o positive what's the o positive o means what they neither have a or a b antigens on the cellular surface but both have antibodies against a and a b right a and a b that's why o positive can give blood to the a positive next talk about the blood group a minus a negative he can give blood to a positive a negative a b positive and of course a b negative right and this person a negative can receive the blood from a negative and o negative right okay let's take b positive similarly in a b positive they can give blood can give blood to b positive of course and the ab positive right that's a simple criteria and they can receive this blood means they can receive the blood from whom b positive blood group they can receive blood from b positive of course the b negative and the o positive and the o negative remember if the person has a blood group o whether it's a negative or uh, what she calls a negative or positive they can donate a blood to a positive negative b positive okay right if the patient has a b negative then he can give blood to b positive b positive and b negative a b positive and a b negative okay and he can receive the blood from whom only the b negative and the o negative remember the more the negative patients will receive the blood from the negative blood group donors only right good let's talk about the other group that's ab positive ab positive group they can receive the blood from whom the only one that's a ab positive means sorry they can give blood to the ob positive only sorry they can give only blood to the ob positive okay and remember the ob positive patients can receive the blood can receive the blood from any type from any type of blood group doesn't matter they can have any type of blood what you call a blood group they can this these patients can receive so lucky fellows in the world they are known as a universal recipient okay if the patient is ab negative ab negative then they can give blood to ab positive and ab negative but they can receive the blood from whom ab negative a negative b negative and the o negative okay let's talk about if the patient is what you call o positive o positive blood can give to o positive a positive of course the b positive and the ab positive can give blood to these patients okay and they can receive the blood from whom from o positive and the o negative right o positive and the o negative so this is really very important that uh, whom the blood should be received and who who will receive and who will not okay if the patient is o negative then he can donate to any one any one or any type of blood group that's why known as universal universal donor okay 
इनवर्सल डोनर इनवर्सल डोनर इनवर्सल डोनर और ओ नेगेटिव एंड दिस पीपल कैन रिसीव द ब्लड ग्रुप फ्रॉम ओनली फ्रॉम वन दैट्स अ ओ नेगेटिव दैट्स इट राइट सो गाइस दिस इज ब्रीफ डिस्कशन थैंक यू सो मच फॉर वाचिंग दिस वीडियो टेक केयर